Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about what does reasonableness and math mean. Well, reasonableness and math means that you're able to validate the solution by verifying the answer. In other words, you'll be able to check your answer by plugging in what you have. So, for example, if you have a simple equation like x plus 7 is equal to 12, and you want to solve for that, subtract 7 on both sides, you have x equals to 5, reasonableness in math means that you can take the 5 and plug it back into the original equation and go from there. So since x is equal to 5, you can plug it in. You have 5 plus 7 is equal to 12, and obviously that solution checks out. Not every solution works, so it's really important that you want to check every answer that you have. Now another example, for, let's just say if you have x over 10 is equal to 2, you can solve for x by multiplying both sides by 10. The tens cancel, you have x is equal to 20. But again, reasonableness in math means are you able to plug in the 20 back into place of x into the original equation. So the original equation was x over 10 equals to 2. So we're going to have 20 for x over 10. And does that equal to 2? Obviously it does. And so for equations like these, it's pretty simple to do, but for more complicated equations, the best thing to apply the reasonableness idea is show every step and leave no stone unturned, and that way, when you do have a solution, just plug in that number back in, and then you can see if that number checks out for every step. So, I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's what does reasonable and reasonableness and math mean.